The big day is just three months away. Can you believe it? It just seems so far from now. I just want it to be tomorrow. Hey. Thanks for agreeing to move to California with me. I love you. dream? Thanks. You can just tell me what's bothering you, okay? <laughs> Baby, it's, it's alright. It's just another dream. No. It's okay. Sarah's. She can give you company when I'm bored, okay? It's okay. You see, I should not be showing this or testing it on anyone except my organization folks, but I think it's okay. <laughs> Ta-da! But you just said you're not allowed to show anyone this. This is wrong, right? Oh, come on, Becky. This is my gadget. I designed this. I guess I can show this to you guys. What is this? This is a device which senses the neural signal activity of our brain, and the computer connected interprets them with the help of artificial intelligence. I am working on an advanced version where you connect these devices to two brains and they transfer signals between each other. Basically, a brain cognition technology is used to convert brain waves into image and words. Damn. Did humans come so far? What is its purpose? It erases all your memory and makes you zombies. Kidding. Huh. <laughs> this is designed to help stroke victims and speech impaired people. All you gotta do is sit with this on your head for a few minutes. You may as well take a short nap. Samir, so, aren't you going to be late for work soon? You know, maybe some other day, Sarah. Thanks. This looks so interesting. Let, let's see what it does. I'll text my pals that I'll be a little late. Back. 
You got to know what happened today. <laughs> Back. I see you're in a lot of pain, and I understand it, but do you realize you are destroying yourself? That's enough, Samir. You've had enough. Just think of Becky. Would she be happy with the way you were dealing with her loss? I cannot think about anything else but her dead, pale face in my hands. Nobody knows what happened. The cops, they suspect I did this. They keep barging every often and, and ask me the same questions again and again.
I need those bloody answers, damn it. You get this, this weird images in my head since the time you connected that, that device to me and my game. I can tell she's scared. But why? From whom? From what? I fucking don't understand anything. <laughs> Tell me, what kind of images do you see? Let me help you, Samir. I can look into the data in my computer. We can see if there's any clue. Samir. I'm there for you. Let's figure this out. Hello, Mrs. Margaret. I'm Samir. We spoke on phone. Sorry for your loss. Becky used to talk about you. She was always thankful for the home you have given her when she was growing up. She was such a good little girl, kind and helpful. So many memories with her. Do you think she was she was worried or scared about anything? I don't know. She was close to me, but she kept her secrets. I have to go to bed. I took my medicine. I can't stay up late. Sorry to bother you. Met Becky's foster mom. Oh. Did she say something? <laughs> but she seemed like a nice woman, as Becky used to say. All right. Now, tell me about the thoughts flashing in your mind you mentioned. Are they random? Do they repeat? Have a pattern? opens into a dark room. A breezy beach. Someone enters the room. I can just see the legs. A wedding stage. So beautiful. Smiles. A bright light. I, I don't know what this means. Okay, okay. This software should combine the brain activity it collected when I connected it to Becky and what you told me now. It translates into all the possible feelings, emotions, and thoughts.
Sir, I know who I should meet. Okay. What are you gonna get? Maybe a rum and coke? Rum and coke it is. <laughs> <laughs> is there someone here? We are leaving. Okay, we can go somewhere else. But we always come here. Matt, foster brother. Why did you run when you saw me? I'm waiting! Tell me, or should I break your head? I'm giving you one last chance to open your fucking mouth. Ah! <laughs> You'll kill me if I tell you. <laughs> I don't know about that. But I'll definitely kill you if you don't tell me. I 
love her to death. Go on. Go on! She is irresistible to me. It was a drunk night we were, when we were teenagers. I came home and saw Becky asleep. She lived here. I, I, I just had to find her. And I did. Get out of my house, Matt. Don't you get it? We are inseparable. We are meant to be together. I know you want me as badly as I want you. Fucking psycho! Okay, just leave me alone. I have a good life now, okay? Don't fucking ruin it again. Your life is only with me! You don't understand, do you? She's either mine or no one's. I'm gonna leave you here to recall your sin. 